Welcome to Bespoke Diaries, today's article is on, From Overcoming Illness to Wellness, by Amarjeet Singh, author, master trainer, acupuncturist, healer, India. Amarjeet's journey to adopting and promoting holistic well-being began about three decades back when he was out of engineering college in Mumbai. He went to the Gulf where he returned to India, not able to fully cope up with the challenges of a civil engineer on site, his health started failing. He became seriously sick and unwell and every day he struggled with loose watery emotions and bleeding. Arnajit actually lost count of his visits to the washroom, and this continued for about six months, taking medications that offered him no improvement, until he was diagnosed with hash ulcerative colitis, inflammation of the large intestine, by a leading gastroenterologist in 1986. Along the way he had lost about 5 kilograms weight due to the illness, he was put on steroids and other medications, instructed not to stop them until advised, steroids were to be tapered off gradually. A slight recovery and he would opt to stop all his medications and his colitis would relapse, in and out of the best hospitals in Mumbai under different specialists on several occasions. He struggled endlessly with the same medications and no lasting relief or effect. He tried different methods for healing as well, however, his suffering did not end so easily and thus he suffered for 13 long years during which he gave up his sight job and started working as a civil engineering contractor in partnership with a friend, which allowed him to remain home on days when he would be unwell. In the year 1999, he happened to read a small newspaper article about a combination of alternative therapies, with a faint hope he tried it and this time it worked. His health improved substantially in just six months. This incident changed his life path altogether and he discovered a new passion, that of helping people in their physical slash mental slash emotional suffering through these alternative therapies. Today he is living an inspired and contended life, he is healthy and his ulcerative colitis has been totally cured since 1999, though a few people tell him he is in remission. Along the way, he has gained weight, and he enjoys eating out regularly which would not be advisable for such a case. This story about Armajit's struggle and ultimately recovery prompted various newspapers slash magazines to interview him during the years since 2000, one that is very appropriately titled The Worst Is Over of March 2009, in the newspaper Hindustan Times from Mumbai. Between 1999 and 2017, we traveled across India and abroad on invitation, sharing, spreading and holding treatment slash lecture camps at various locations for various organizations, individuals and were very fortunate to be offered a slot daily on the Ask the Channel. Propagating acupressure therapy and systems in 2006, which continues to be broadcast worldwide along with his co-host and colleague Ms. Shilpa Kedikar, available at www.theawaninga.in. Life is a journey and like any journey, it also has its risks many times we fall prey to the pitfalls of ignorance, in that, we damage our mind stream and our consciousness which leads to the imbalance of energy in the physical body as well. Any injury or disease is only a reflection of our imbalance within. The therapies whether focusing on the mind or body help us restore our lost balance and when that is achieved healing is the spontaneous consequence. The realization of this simple process can end our futile search for complex remedies. Nature is simple and so is our body, and it knows how to keep itself healthy and efficient. Only a faulty intervention is what causes suffering which can happen through bad diet and lifestyle, wrong and negative thinking, disempowering beliefs and lack of self, love and self-esteem. If we learn to cultivate a healthy lifestyle, we will not require any intensive health care throughout our life. Even in severe slash complex cases we, have proved that natural therapies have worked, towards the end of the book, we have presented various such complex health issues that, we could treat with very good outcomes beyond any doubts, and proof of successful treatment results are in form of tabulated results slash and pictures before and after treatment in cases of visible results. It is only our own willingness to adopt them that is needed. Our vision is to spread the message about this integrated approach of using alternative therapies. 
millions of people are dying every year due to physical suffering, which can be easily eliminated. Today more than high-end drugs and complex treatments we need a holistic approach and an army of healers that do the work required. Without healthy life is not life, it is only a state of languor and suffering an image of death. Buddha let us all nurture a healthy state of body and mind and be alive. Wishing everyone enough in life, always. Thank you for your time. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share. Do leave your thoughts in the comments section below. For similar type of article please reach us at contact at thebespokediaries.com or you can visit our website www.thebespokediaries.com.